I'm back out here just down from the uh, where the train derailed and I'm back here it's a week later it's exactly a week almost the same time of day actually that the uh, train derailed Saturday last week so we're back out here I tried to get out here earlier but the uh, FAA put a flight restriction on and then uh, they removed that restriction then DJI who makes my f f drone they still had a restriction, wouldn't let me take off, so I had to contact them. And then yesterday it was drizzly, and I knew my camera would just be covered, and I couldn't see anything. So now I'm finally out here. I'm guessing they have the bridge fixed. I don't know. We haven't seen them haul any cars out, but I haven't been here a lot this week, so I don't know. We'll find out together. As you can see, they have the bridge fixed. The tracks look like they should be open. And they're doing something on the tracks yet, not exactly sure what. And they moved all the locomotives and the derailed cars into the neighboring field here. I'm gonna cut in a couple clips from a week ago, just so you can see the vast difference in the amount of trees that they took out and how much rock they brought in to facilitate this reopening of the train and the recovery of the cars. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, click the like button or the subscribe button below and we'll see you on the next one.